The painting entitled Orchid and Hummingbird near a mountain waterfall was painted by Martin Joseph Heide in 1902. The piece is between landscape and still life, and it is an oil on canvas. The subject is a tropical landscape with an orchid and a hummingbird in the foreground, and it has a simple organization with few options. On the left, we can see a big pink orchid with a hummingbird on one leaf. Under them, there is a trunk full of ivy that rises to the top left hand corner of the painting. In the background, we see the out of focus mountains which are behind the cloudy sky. In front of the mountains, there is a waterfall that breaks the thickness of the jungle. In this painting, the elements are defined by small brush strokes of color that emphasize the sensual and emotive power of the composition. Heather was very impressed by the overflowing landscapes of South America. He painted a lot of pieces with hummingbirds and orchids that were an original idea at the time because this subject had never been painted in this format. We can see the experience left in this painting by the use of vivid colors, so we can say there is paint elements. The forms are defined through chiaroscuro and look highly finished, but it does not have sense of texture. The hummingbird creates a dialogue with the flower through the position of its head and the amethyst horn of its neck. The colors in those two principal elements and the jungle are highly saturated, but the colors of the mountain and the sky are not. In the piece, Hede created the idea of spatial recession using perspective. There is contrast between the areas of light and darkness which help to create the effect of chiaroscuro. The painting is life-size. We can see the small mountains in the back and the big flower in the front because of the spatial recession. The composition seems to be simple and accidental. There is not symmetry. The painting is spacious with some areas more crowded. The warm colors of the yellow and the amethyst emphasize the role of the hummingbird and the orchid. The grey of the sky and the green of the fertile plants made us feel like we are in the middle of the jungle. That explosion of colors reminds us of the atmosphere of the South American landscape.